As the film industry takes off in New Mexico, some unusual local businesses are taking off too. News 13's Francesca Washington shows you why. From a fleet of LAPD patrol units. We had a bunch of cars we had to convert to. To Jesse Pinkman's getaway vehicle used at the end of El Camino. Owner of Southwest Picture Cars, Jay Vigil, has about 200 cars in his Albuquerque lot. They range from your cop cars, buses, ambulances, uh, just everyday cars. And all of them have been used in TV shows and movies. I have two Land Rovers that, uh, that were on Planet of the Apes. He's not the only local business owner benefiting from the state's film boom. There's all kinds of objects and uh, material goods and makers and creators that are employed when a production comes to town. And you can find all 1,500 support services on the state film office's website. From gunsmiths, art galleries that rent out pieces to productions, to animal trainers. The movie business boomed in Albuquerque. Uh, we got very busy. Oh, good boy. Lisa Berry with Custom Canine Performance Training has been training film animals for 15 years. The producers will call us and tell us what type of animal they would like and what actions they would like it to do and we would go through the dogs that we have trained and find the one that closely matched. Barry says this Presa Canario has been in several movies, most recently Creed 2 that was filmed last year in southern New Mexico. This year there were 80 productions filmed in New Mexico and according to the film office most of them take advantage of our local resources. It's really a lot of fun and we really enjoy what we do. Francesca Washington, Care QE, and that's a wrap. News 13. <laughs> In order to be listed on the support services page, businesses have to have a New Mexico address and tax ID. Companies are also vetted by the film office.